That's Taipei Main Station. In the next 24 hours, I'm going to take trains 360 degrees around the island of Taiwan. So let's roll. One of the most convenient things about taking the train around Taiwan is that for almost all the trains, from a city metro ride to a local express, you can pay for and ride with a simple swipe of a card. This is Taiwan's easy card. And it not only makes travel easy, but it can also very conveniently be topped up at a local ticket vending machine or your nearest 7-Eleven. But today, at least to start out, we're going old school paper tickets. From Taipei Main Station, we're headed to Taitong. That journey is going to take about four hours. And with that, we're going to knock out most of the eastern seaport of Taiwan's railway system. Here in Taiwan, one of the most densely populated landmasses in the world, railroads are a way of life. In the year 2016 alone, over a billion passengers traveled by rail in Taiwan, averaging 3 million passengers per day. Many elect for the modern convenience of the high-speed rail, which can take you from Taipei in the north to Kaohsiung in the south in under two hours. But today, is all about taking things slow. No high-speed rail. We are riding only express trains around the island to get a closer look at Taiwan's scenery, its transportation, and the system that keeps it chugging along. It is now 10.39 and I've arrived here at Taitung Station, a true little oasis on this scorching hot July Taiwan day. This place feels more like a Southeast Asian artsy hipster market than it does a train station. I've picked up some dumplings here for lunch and in about 45 minutes we're going to be taking train number two, a local train from Taitung all the way to Kaohsiung. But until that time, I'll just be sitting here enjoying the hipster vibes and eating my dumplings. We've made it around the bend. It is now 2.20 and I'm currently standing in Kaohsiung Station where I'm getting ready to complete the last leg of this journey. In about 15 minutes or so, I'm gonna be getting on a train that's gonna be going directly to Taipei Station. It's gonna take about four hours. You don't truly know Taiwan until you understand its railway system. It is the past, present, and future of this island. Imagine Taiwan as if it were a jigsaw puzzle. When you live in a place like I lived here in 2017, you get to know a few pieces of that jigsaw puzzle really well. But this train trip six years later was the first time I really felt like I got a big picture view of all those pieces put together. For the first time today, I know Taiwan on an intimate level. And hey, there's plenty Taiwan and I haven't yet experienced in our relationship together. But once you round all the bases, you've seen everything you need to see and there ain't no going back. If you enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a like and click here to follow me along on the rest of my Taiwan adventures. I'll see y'all for the next episode.